Uh, um, you started using Facebook a uh, year and a half ago and what has changed in you, if anything, about opinions, if anything, um, over the year and a half? Okay. Well, first of all, um, when I met you, I was at a, a very tough time in my life. And through you, you opened doors to Pakistan. I mean, I was talking to a few people, but it was just like throwing the doors wide open and, and giving me the world. Um, I have have been so touched. I, I cry sometimes uh, when I leave um, because the people are so kind. I, I'm asked sometimes, what do you think of Pakistan? First of all, your country is amazingly beautiful. I had never seen Pakistan uh, before, as I have now. From, from each region, I, I get pictures and friends. Um, I just, it's, it's, it's hard to describe. Um, I love Pakistan. <laughs> That's all there is to it. And through you, I, I didn't just get like one friend or two friends or whatever. Um, I find Pakistan is spread all over the world. Um, I, I'm, a, I'm amazed where you pop up at, you know, where people are, are working at jobs and, and what have you. And for many, I'm the first American they've ever talked to, um, which I am honored and sad at the same time that more Americans don't reach out. And, and talk to Pakistan. Um, I, um, so how has that changed you or how has it helped you doing it, all this? Okay. Well, okay. Now for me, I'm an adventurer. So I have never had a problem with meeting people or talking to people or asking questions. I look at life as a puzzle. You know, I may find a story or somebody may ask me something and, and I go and I try to find an answer um, or, you know, try to see a picture. One thing that threw me for a loop was the ladies kept talking about making pen, pendy or lady finger, excuse me, lady fingers. I'm going, what on earth are lady fingers? And so finally someone posted a picture and here it was okra. Well, okra we have in the United States. So I've learned a lot of words. Um, I've learned some Urdu. Um, I hope to learn more. Um, and, uh, oh, wow. <laughs> um, okay. <laughs> Did it help you? Did you think you were a better person by using and talking to these people? Oh, yes. Yes. Um... I find the, the Pakistanis to be very warm and caring and loving people. Um, as, as I say, I wish that more Americans would talk to Pakistan. Um, I find, you know, that is, that is the one thing that I have found more than anything. People are scared to death to talk to one another. And all it takes is the word is hi. I'm from America. Or, you know, and your name. And, uh, and the conversation begins. Um, I don't know how to turn this around. I've been unfriended. <laughs> I've been asked, why are you talking to them? And I don't understand the mentality of people. We all agree the, the news medias have done a, done a number on, on all of us. Um, but I found... And, and I found this when my husband was in the military. We have wonderful people here in the United States, but we also have snobs. Uh, they don't want to eat anything different. They don't want to talk anything different, wear anything different. Um, I don't know if that's so much in Pakistan, because I, I haven't really found a whole lot of that. But I'm a firm believer you give what you get. If you're kind to people, you get kindness back. And that's what I do. So. Thank you, Pamela. Mm -hmm.